Thank you everyone for joining us once again and welcome to Mercy High School Visual and Performing Arts Department. Um, I am Ms. Baroudi and I teach 3D art and that consists of ceramics and a 3D art class. We also have Ms. Azal who teaches 2D art, drawing, painting, printmaking and non-darkroom photography. We have Ms. J who teaches uh, dance. We have Mr. Cervantes who teaches chorale and we also have a yearbook class and that is taught by Ms. Huli. And we have tri-school classes offered, VPA tri-school classes offered at SERA and that is drama and band. Um, all our uh, art classes we have all the way from beginner levels to uh, intermediate to honors and then they lead up to uh, AP. And um, all our classes also have National Art Honor Society. So the honors and AP students are members with the honor societies. In 3D art, um, the 3D arts in general, we have ceramics and 3D art. The students get comprehensive instruction and they learn uh, skill building. And in ceramics, I encourage hand building and wheel work from the beginning, from level one. Uh, students are encouraged to um, show creative expression and their personal style is highly encouraged. Um, we also study artists and historical context uh, exploration and we also have uh, different guest artists and this year we had the honor of having Ms. Christine Mays whose artwork is featured right now at the Filoli Gardens up to November 9th. Um, all the students starting in level one, they have a digital portfolio that they build up on all the way through their AP class. We do visit uh, museums and local galleries. And as mentioned earlier, the honors and AP members are members with the National Arts Honor Society. Ms. Azel? Okay, I teach all of the 2D art classes. Um, most kids start with art one. And we really focus on skill building, but we also explore all the different mediums. And that's so you can kind of start figuring out what you really want to use for your portfolio as you continue on. Um, we all, all the classes have a portfolio. You get to add to it, whether you take my, my class or Ms. Baruti's um, to show your skill level and different things you've made. The portfolios are great for when it's time to apply for college or side jobs or whatever you're interested in. These classes also allow the students to be members of the National Art Under Society. And um, the photos just give you an idea of the different levels. The first two are level one, and then the second one is level two. The last two are AP students. Thank you. And then for no darkroom photography, um, the classes are a little bit smaller, which is nice, it's hands-on. We make a lot of different things from photos to um, tunnel books using photography, GIFs. We made a commercial for the Burlingame Parks and Rec Department. That was a lot of fun. We use Photoshop. Right now we've been using Lightroom. Mercy provides Photoshop for the students on campus. But when we're not on campus, we have to use, you know, sometimes cheaper things. So Lightroom, which is also great for editing. And um, one of the photography classes is tri so one class is co-ed and one class is girls only. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Azal. Um, Ms. Jay? Hi, everyone. I'm Ms. Jay. I am the dance instructor here at Mercy. I teach all of our dance courses, one through six honors, and I am also the dance coach for our after-school uh, dance team. Um, the dance one classes are typically for students who have never had any dance experience or have had very little dance experience. And um, we go all the way to our six honors classes, which are typically girls who have been dancing at Mercy for some time with me or came into Mercy having had prior dance experience already. Um, during our classes, we don't focus on just one style of dance. We focus on several, um, which include ballet, jazz, modern, tap, and hip hop dance techniques. Um, we also focus on history and um, vocabulary and terminology in our courses. And of course, we learn um, dances. We learn choreography, um, which ends in a dance concert at the end of the semester that uh, students um, perform um, for their families and friends on stage in a theater um, with costumes, the whole shebang. Um, our honors students, those that are um, dance uh, for honors through six honors, 
are also members of the National Honor Society of Dance. Um, and yes, uh, we there is a video on this slide that you can take a look at after um, this slideshow will be um, available on our website, which shows uh, what we did last year. We had a virtual um, dance concert since COVID happened, and um, those are some of our Dance One girls performing if you want to take a look at what we did last year. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. J. Mr. Cervantes. Hi, everybody. Uh, I'm Mr. Cervantes, and I teach choral also known as choir. I love to teach a uh, technique, vocal technique, how to sing and make it sound nice. Um, I like to teach proper breathing and confidence. Uh, I think choir builds a lot of confidence. Uh, so I, that's one part of it that I really love. Uh, we teach, I teach you how to read music and how to learn how to perform in front of people. It's a great skill to have. And I love treble choir. This is all girls. Uh, girls voices are powerful when you put them all together. It's just a power sound. I love the sound of it. And I think you will too. And that we also offer a tri M choir that is connected with the other schools with Sarah and Notre Dame. Uh, so it's a really fun program. I hope you'll uh, join. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Cervantes. Um, so we also have yearbook, and as I said, Ms. Huli teaches yearbook. Ms. Huli is also an English teacher, so right now she's presenting with the English department. Um, so the yearbook class is an actual class building with a schedule, and the students work in teams to design the yearbook pages. They collaborate as a class to brainstorm theme and style for the year. Uh, students develop time management um, and organizational and leadership skills. Students learn about photography with a focus on photojournalism and how to tell a story. And on top of that, the students will become familiar with yearbook design software. Um, on top of everything that we offer in-house, we have drama and band, and we have the production of plays and musicals at uh, Sarah High School, which is our sister's school and part of the tri-school program that is offered here at Mercy. Um, and ladies, please make sure you keep an eye and ear on your art teacher about this uh, middle school art competition. It is a 2D and 3D art competition that we usually host in the spring. And uh, so your artwork, please save your artwork so you can present it um, into the competition and for a chance to win a prize. So thank you so much for visiting us. 